Hey guys, it's Justin here from Jack Production Studios, and welcome back to another LEGO mock video. So this is a video from my LEGO Star Wars clone base in Corellia. So it's been probably like four months since I started this. I probably spent like two of those on and off building, and then I decided not to build for <laughs> the other two of those months, but that's because it was the end of the school year. Anyway, I'm finally glad to have this out because I um, definitely, I, this was supposed to be faster, and then I just ended up not building for two months, but yeah. So uh, we're going to start off with a battlefield here. Starting off here, over here, we have this droid force, and they're being led by Grievous. And uh, yeah, so this is AAT, some super battle droids, and regular battle droids there. Behind them, there would be more forces, but as you guys can probably tell, this is a smaller uh, battlefield than what I normally have. So I had to just limit the amount of droids I had to make this not look like um, just you know spanned with droids and stuff. Yeah, and then over here we have this clone force, and they're going to go assist the droids. They're probably just returning to the base and then realize, oh, hey, they're being attacked, so they're heading over there to help assist. And, the yeah, so the terrain, um, I have tan, dark tan, sand green, and uh, regular green, and then dirt. They're just uh, kind of like, I was doing something different here, using different colors, and I thought that turned out pretty cool. And I did some cool, like, layering along it. Let's put some indents and stuff. And here we have this river. And the base is obviously put behind it just so it has a bit of defense against like an AAT or something. So they have to force the only entrance point to the base to be through there, through that bridge. And uh, yeah. Just a bit of terrain there, but not much. And then there's some of the base design. Uh, these things, they go underground or like into the water kind of and like suck water up through there and into the base there's three of those there and i'll show you guys what those are used for once i get to that um yeah so the entrance entrance is over here and it's a slanted wall with a bridge there up there there's two satellite dishes some cool uh just printed six by six dishes there and then up here on top of the curved wall i'll show that by the way there's the pattern on there Anyway, on top of here, we have two snipers there, and then we have this landing platform with Kenobi Starfighter. He's getting out to go probably fight Gravis. <laughs> you can only assume, and if he doesn't fight them, well, fight him, then they're kind of screwed. But, um, yeah, so now I'm going to get on to the whole uh, interior of this. Yeah, let me just remove the roof to this section to start off. All right, so the roof has been removed. I just want to point out one thing. There is a little uh, hole here to get down at the base, and there's a ladder there. There's a clone that was on the ladder, and he's kind of being uh, killed right there, I guess. <laughs> but anyway, uh, now onto the command center. So, um, there's, yeah, there's this curved wall here, and then there's a command center in there. I guess it continues over here. But, um, yeah. So I guess we can start off over here. There's just some supplies that they've probably gotten from a recent, like, gunship or something like that. And, uh, yeah, there's a clone there taking inventory. And there's an astromech droid there. This clone, who should be looking at the hologram. And he's probably talking to some uh, fleet admiral or whatever, just trying to uh, let them know what's going on. And here's a clone looking at a hologram of, you know, the base and the surrounding area. I don't know why he's looking at the backside of it. <laughs> Yeah, anyway, then there's uh, these two clones here who are one clone. I didn't put one there. Anyway, this is a clone here who's on uh, just some computer thing, and then there's an empty computer right there. I guess that one hasn't been turned on. Uh, yeah, so now over here we have this hologram table with a clone and I guess an admiral there talking to someone else, possibly on a venator, and then there's a computer right there with an officer working on that and then another officer working on that computer and uh yeah so i guess that's pretty much it for this floor so i'll just remove this and show you guys the uh i guess the first floor of the base all right so now on to uh here we have four rooms here and starting off over here here's the uh, mass hall cafeteria area it's currently empty because obviously the clones are going out to fight or are in the communications room yeah, we just have an area for them to get their food, and there's some containers of food, and there's uh, two tables with containers of food on them. And then we, we have this hallway here, which goes down this entire floor. And in here we have this clone barracks, I guess. 
barracks. Um, got two clones who are currently resting. They're on top of the bunk beds. And then we just have these little like, cubbies for them to put their armor in. Or like, anything personal theirs that they don't want to sleep with, obviously. <laughs> but, um, yeah, so now on to this room. This is rather dark. Try to bring the light over. Alright, so this is the, I guess, armory room. So some areas for guns. So there's two walls there. And then over here, there are some helmet racks. Four there. And, yeah. And now over here, so this is the med bay. There's just a medical drawer there, a computer, and then just two beds for waiting clones who've been injured. Yeah. Uh, by the way, there's a staircase that goes up from the top floor all the way down to the uh, basement area. And I'll show you guys that in a moment. So through this doorway here, uh, this clone's exiting to, uh, to battle. Um, there's like this hangar bay. And starting up over here, uh, yeah, we have these three platforms here. One has a clone running across to get to the stairs and out of the base. Uh, these other two have speeders on them. That speeder's exiting to go fight the battle. That one hasn't been occupied yet. Yeah. Anyway, so uh, yeah, so there's some platforms for the speeders um, over here. There's a control panel probably to like put up a ray shield for the door. And then there's this uh, fuel tank here. And this can just be hooked up to one of those speeder bikes to refuel them. Obviously, that's on a very large amount of fuel. They'll definitely need more. But anyway, yeah. So I guess I'm just gonna remove this for quickly and then show you guys. Uh, what's in the basement area. Alright, so now on to the final floor of the base. And, yes, yeah, so this is the basement floor. So starting off down here, we have this hallway that goes down, all, goes from the stairs all the way down. And we have uh, three separate hallways that lead to the generators that are right there. So there are the generators. There's one, two, and three. Um, so those pipes right there end up going down. I didn't actually end up building it, but they go down into here, then to the generator. By the way, sorry about all this filler. I just uh, <laughs> didn't really have much to put there. So it's all filler, but yeah. So here we just have the three generators, hallways that go down. Uh, this clone probably came down here to check on it. It's now heading up to go join the battle. And uh, yeah, that's really it for this. Alright, so I hope you guys enjoyed the mock. This mock did end up uh, being a bit rushed in the end because I had to make time for another mock at the start soon, which is my Fox Company Season 2 mock. This is a collab between a bunch of us uh, people on Instagram and YouTube, so I'll definitely um, keep you guys updated on that. If you guys don't follow me on social media, like, well, I guess Instagram and occasionally Twitter, um, make sure to follow those. Links to those will be in the description down below. I post a lot on Instagram and then occasionally on Twitter. Mostly just custom stuff on Twitter, and I think it's all custom on Twitter, and then Instagram has all of it. But, uh, yeah. So, definitely look forward to that. And, yeah, while this mock was a bit rushed, I definitely um, ended up liking some of the things that I was able to do with it. Like new terrain techniques and all that. But, yeah, so I'm just going to wrap this up now. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.